Hi Neat Aspirants, welcome to Unacademy Neat English. I am your biology educator Ambika Sharma and in today's video I am going to tell you about the practical biology syllabus and I am going to tell you uh, whether you should revise it or not. So first of all let me make this thing very clear to you all that this particular video is for those who are done with the revision of their NCRT once or twice, right? Even if once you have completed your class 11th and class 12th syllabus of biology, right, your NCRT reading, then definitely you should read the practical biology syllabus as well. And I'll tell you which chapter you need to focus more and which chapter you need to leave. So students, when we check the official syllabus, right, Bache? So in that official syllabus part, I'm particularly talking about the biology as of now. So you know that in the structural organization of uh, plants and animals, they have mentioned in front of that morphology part, right? I think I think I should show you this thing first. So it is mentioned now uh, to be dealt along with the relevant practical of the practical syllabus, right? Even in locomotion and movement, the same thing is mentioned. So most of the time, students they ask that uh, sh should they focus on such things or they should ignore it. So let me tell you students, if you are willing to score 360 out of 360, so you know that what we have to do first, we need to revise the complete biology, right? Uh, complete NCERT biology. And in that NCERT, we are not allowed to leave even the summary part, the theory part, the exercise questions, the description of the diagrams, not even a single word. So if you really want to score 360 out of 360, so basically uh, no stone should should be left unturned that should be our attitude right bache so i hope you people understand this thing now why what is that practical syllabus or what things we should focus and what things we should ignore let me tell you this let's take the example of your uh, a locomotion and movement chapter you all can see one QR code here right so if you scan this QR code there will be one website there and when you click on that obviously the question related to this part will open up right uh, I, a few months back also I made one video where I sh uh, where I explained you people like uh, I'll give you one example you know the chapter living word now from this chapter now from this chapter taxonomical aids they are deleted right but but when you scan this qr code when you see the questions there in that few uh, in few questions they even ask the questions on the basis of taxonomic aid i'm talking about the new ncrt here so basically this qr code it it uh, it did redirect us to you know the questions to the practical part this and that okay so what do you have to do what you should do right you can use this you can scan it you can solve the question and now specifically if i talk about the practical biology what you people can do you can definitely scan it but yeah when i was trying to do it was showing some error so what i did directly on the google bache i just typed this thing let me show you right the ncrt right the ncrt biology just a minute let me show you here i'll show you the websites these are the official websites okay these are the official website ncr ncert.nic.in if you will write if you will go to that website you can download the biology of your class 11th uh, and uh, you can download the ncrt of your class 11th biology class 12th biology even the physics and chemistry whatever you want right people now now if you want to download the lab manual directly directly you can mention this thing like class 11th ncrt uh, lab manuals your class 12th lab manuals directly you are going to wait let me show you yes so you will just a minute okay so see this is the page that will come okay so from this lab manual part you have to click on this lab manual part right bache again one tab will open and when you will open up this tab this tab will take you to the different different parts like different different books will be different different grades and different different subjects will be there like mathematics is given na? so we are looking for the class 11th biology part so here you can see right the practicals here see the biology you have to click on these different different exercises okay okay and you will get the detail like I, I clicked on exercise 2 so they are telling me to identify and study the morphology of representative types of bacteria fungi and different plant groups right so here no doubt they have explained the procedure they explained the points related to the bacteria right their systemic position the examples are given you all can see here right but it is also as per NCRT right so so classification again rhizopus has explained there so you can see they have added many things there so my 
advice here is right if you are targeting 360 out of 360 and you are done with the ncrt revision once or twice so from that particularly from that structural organization in animal and plant chapter and locomotion and movement chapter the topic that they have specified that they are going to ask as per the practical biology syllabus you should focus on that so i'll show you here the different different tabs here right there are different different tabs here so you can see this one this is exercise 9 so it is telling us about the modification of leaf right leaf modifications are given different examples are given right so they are not going to ask any question beyond ncrt but in ncrt many things are hidden and that's what i'm trying to show you here so see examples of this nepenthes is given onion bulb example is given for the storage right few questions are given here that you can read and answer and focus on this part different type of inflorescence in our syllabus we know that we have racemos and we have cymos so here they have they have see they have added the plant their type right the questions here how is floral different from a flower like this right so you can also you can also use this data this lab manual for the revision race more cymos is given here right 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 they have explained you few examples as well okay so you can use this data for your revision fine bache fine bache so it is covering your complete ncrt so now see there is one more practical here so i'm particularly specifying morphology part so see study and describe flowering plants of family solanaceae fabaceae and liliaceae and here also they mentioned the procedure the questions are given you can pick up that questions for the revision of families part right you can focus on type of placenta you can focus on type of flower so see here estivation is explained number of stamens right but check gynecium position everything from that families it is mentioned here so you can use these lab manuals for your quick revision okay so guys first of all complete your syllabus right read your ncrt practice mcqs if you when you're done with it then focus on these things clear but so one or two questions can come from these things right two to three questions can also come but yeah you know that option part is also there so i am not here to demotivate you people and to put pressure on you here i finish your ncrt then you have this to do that to do but yeah all i want to tell is that be focused complete your syllabus once you are done then focus on this side now i know some students will be like yo ma'am uh we didn't complete the ncrt yet so what we what we need to do from this part there is nothing to worry about when we will take the lectures whatever question related to practicals are there in these manuals we are going to ask that questions in our classes also so don't worry about this just subscribe to this channel stay tuned to this channel bache and please 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 keep revising so quickly make us the 100k subscriber family quickly just do it right now subscribe to our channel look at this look at this amazing channel where you are getting all the important updates that you need and moreover bache just for you people right we have uh, started our i hope you all are aware of it our neat end game crash course as well where we are right now discussing the human physiology so link is given in the description box of this video as well click on that link be the part of that batch and keep revising your ncrt biology properly your paper is going to come from the ncrt biology only so all the best take care thank you so much